actually. I joined psychiatry way back in 1985 and passed out in 1988 uh, and then even came immediately into my private practice. It was an era where still psychiatry was in a nascent phase in our country. We were dealing with a sudden onslaught of a lot of psychiatric problems, but we did not have enough of modalities to help our psychiatric patients, especially those patients suffering from very chronic mental Ill mental illnesses like schizophrenia, bipolar mood disorder, obsessive compulsive disorder, and addict chronic addictions. I started a state of the art psychiatry unit in Masina Hospital in 1990 onwards. What uh, with indoor facilities over here. What was happening is that whenever we admit, you know, whenever we were treating acute cases, after the treat acute problem, when they went back into the community, we always felt that the treatment was incomplete bit because very soon those patients either stopped their medications or they were not able to be properly re reintegrated into the community, into the society. They were not able to get back into their normal, you know, responsibility and duties a normal life only because we did not at that point of time have the concept of psychosocial rehabilitation that was one area which we were really lacking there were very rare very few centers available in our country at that point of time somewhere about 12 to 13 years back i came across a wonderful couple sushupti and ronnie who hailed from Pune, they had come to meet me. We met on a number of occasions and they started absolutely, you know, like a barefoot people in the city of Pune, starting from one small bungalow. And gradually, gradually the need was so high that, you know, all over Pune, they had about 14 to 16 such bungalows where they admitted about 15 to 25 patients in each centers they uh, were having wonderful young uh, counselors, psychiatric social workers, psychologists, occupational therapists, and they really were working very hard in the amongst the recovering patients. This patient, when they spent approximately three months in these centers, and when they came back into community, they were performing much much better. Their insight improved much better. Their judgment improved much better, their self-care improved much better, their understanding of their own illness as well as the importance of their medication improved much better and they were able to take up responsibilities in life. That is how my relation with Chaitanya started. Chaitanya over the period of years grew because the need in our country was very very high. Chaitanya started with three centers in Pune, they eventually spread out to Goa to Cochin, now in Gurgaon. For some time it was, they were also having a center in near Mumbai, but because of the people who, you know, who own that place, they had to take it back. So we are really in Mumbai, we are lacking for such a place. I have had wonderful relationship and the people at Chaitanya are so down to earth. They are like absolutely, they are like, you know, saints, I would say. They are like the priests, their fathers, the you know the the, the nuns who work in you know charitable institutions like schools, hospitals. Uh, they, I mean, there's only one thing that they believe in that is de dedicated care with full devotion. There's you know they are not at all money minded. The, if at all you ever go over there, these places are reasonably simple, reasonably priced, and the way they take care of the patients, it's marvelous it's amazing and uh, I mean the patients are all very happy over there the family is very happy over there of late of course work is you know the burden of uh, patients is increasing like anything uh, these days to get more and more trained psychiatric social workers fully devoted is a big problem lots of people come join up over there but eventually they want to go for you know better job prospects and all these kinds of problems are there but you know it's a learning phase uh, Chaitanya is kind of you know they keep evolving they keep bringing in newer and newer concepts they have a lot of uh, you know uh, wonderful activities for the patients creative activities for the patients 
they also help them in vocational training there are so many young kids whom i who were my patients and who went there and who kept on staying there and you know from there they also managed to complete their studies and today they are you know in different different professions so hats off to chaitanya they are one doing a wonderful job job the the management of chaitanya are absolutely devoted people dedicated people roni sushupti prince and all the people of i don't know how many these days the nurses the even the psychiatrists who are working over there dr rohan jagirdar dr zainab dr uh, dr uh, watwe sahab dr chogle sahab they are all wonderful people they are all you know they they really give wonderful care and uh, we we need uh, we, we need more chaitanyas all over the country i believe ki every every city every district should have such chaitanya centers